morning ladies and gentlemen. We're gonna be detecting today. It's gonna be very, very rainy, but uh, we're gonna try out the Fisher today, the Fisher F75. I haven't used this in quite a while, but we're gonna give it a go. This is a place we've pounded before, but we always find something, so let's give it a shot before it starts raining more. It's supposed to pour today so much. But I got a rain jacket, we'll see how long we can go. If it starts raining real bad, I gotta put this away because it's not waterproof. I got the other one though. All right, folks, I was just getting a pretty bad signal, but it was jumping up into the 40s and 50s, so I decided to dig it. And it was very far down in the bottom of that hole. And this sucker is awesome. I'm not exactly sure what it is, but that's a beautiful old piece of iron. Probably had a rope going through it or something. Either went that way or this way, but when I got it out of the hole, I decided to go over it again, and we got another target. And look what came out of there. Beautiful, beautiful suspender clasp. Oh, that's gorgeous, and it looks like it has some patent stuff on it. Let me try to get this sucker cleaned up. That's gorgeous. March 7, and then it's cracked. It's another March something. Can't tell if it's 1870 something or the date part is actually broken off. There's a seven there, right at the top. Seven, seven, maybe? 1877? Bob's walking up to me with his uh, happy face on. Let's see what he's got. <sighs> Woo! Let me, uh... Oh, my word. 1868 shield nickel the absolute best looking shield nickel I have ever seen in my entire life oh my word that thing is like AU good night Wow 1868 shield nickel looking freaking amazing Wow, that thing honestly looks about the nicest you could possibly ever dig. Oh my word. That, that is perfect. You can't beat that. Absolutely perfect. Wow. Bob did it again. You got a nicer. Holy smokes. That is awesome. These people had money. That's for darn sure. That is a fancy doorknob. And this place was absolutely gone by the, like, before um, World War II. These were, these people were gone before then. I think the house is left abandoned for a while. That's awesome. That's a fancy doorknob. Alright folks, I got the most ugliest iron signal in the world and I decided to dig down just in case it was a pit. I'm not sure if it's a pit or not, but there's a whole bottle. I'm pretty excited about this one. I've never seen one anyone I have never seen one like this. It's a cork top. I don't think it has any embossing though, unfortunately. That would be amazing. It's got bubbles galore. It's a pretty old one. It's not no modern. Okay. All right, it's, a, it's definitely a 1900 or to like 1920, but that's a cool one. It's very off center, a lot of bubbles. There could very easily be a little bottle dump here. Yeah, there's more glass in the hole. Okay. 
I thought that was like a giant old reliable eye water one, but that's awesome. I like that bottle. Bob just came back from going on a little patrol. He uh, got a couple what's-its. That might have something to do with the strap. I'm not quite sure what these two pieces are. And there's a ring. This is what I really want to show you guys. Let me get you in macro so you can see it. Okay, it says Adela. And it's got a beautiful little pattern around it. This is a very old kid's ring with a heart engraved. Too bad it's not uh, silver or gold, but that's an incredible, nice old copper child's ring. That looks pretty Victorian. I mean, it could be 20s or so, but just has that pattern to it. Adela. That's beautiful. Awesome. Little girl's ring. We just stopped to detect Bob poop. He got a very old silver plated spoon and he found an iron patch. Beautiful. We're going to head over to the back and detect it. <laughs> amazing target right here I gotta show you I gotta do a live dig on it it could be a can but I doubt it it's ringing too high let's check it out it's got a little size to it turn it up so you can hear it That could be a coin. It's like 82 to 84 ish. Oops. Let's see if we can get to it. under a root. Oh no. Here it is. Copper wire. I thought it was too good to be true. There we go. There's, this place probably wasn't dug before. Look what Mr. Bob just found. Holy smokes. 1864. That is a freaking gorgeous one. Civil War era lantern part beautiful patented March 1st 1864 convex it's got a beautiful star on it wow that is amazing that is the best looking one of them I've ever never seen congrats dude we're definitely finding some bits and pieces of some old stuff now Beautiful. Check that out. We got a stencil. I'm going to try to open her up and see exactly what she says. It probably has a date and maybe a name of a business. There's probably some orange groves around here. Or it's from the railroad. We're literally right by the railroad. Alright, let's show you around up here. Um, two sites. But uh, we only spent maybe an hour here. We don't have very much time. We spent multiple hours earlier at another site there's all my stuff court Corton and company 1825 new york that's probably like showing where it goes the company probably on a box of oranges or something it's either 1825 or 1925 would be like the code for where the box goes rimfire uh, we got a bunch of coins here. Those are modern. We got an old handmade fishing sinker. It's not molded. We got this nice piece of old lead. 
That's off of an old belt. Not too terribly old, but an old belt. Um, we got the copper wire. I believe that's part of a lantern. I got a weedy. Uh, 52. Thought I had another one, 20 something. Railroad penny. You can kind of see the Lincoln thing there. Little hook. Um, yeah, that's it for me. Some iron. Bob, got a knife. That's at the last place. Best find of the day by four. Uh, patented March 1st, 1864. Oil lamp. Beautiful shape. Amazing. Best, one of the best ones I've ever seen. You got a spoon, silver plated spoon. Uh, three Wheaties today. You got a 1920-something. Oh, and you got a H. And, uh... Oh, that's a modern one, but... 1910. Beautiful. Thank you all for watching, and we'll see you all in the next.